The darkness is coming. The end is near. You can't. Jesus! Oh my God! What did you do? That was a little extreme, Commander. You can't just go around whacking people in the head. Just a little bump on the head. Let him sleep it off. So I want to welcome you to Mass Effect. Uh, I was sleeping on these games growing up. I always read them off as, you know, nerdy crap. But Fallout really opened my eyes to these kind of action RPGs. So, yeah, I figured I'd give it a go. Uh, these will be kind of similar to what I do with Fallout 4, where the, the videos are like hours upon like almost one to two hours long just because it's an RPG it's not really something you can break up and then like parts without like, getting tedious so just so start a new career welcome to Alliance military database classified information requested believe it or not I actually managed to mod this game secure connection confirmed Please log in to access your profile. Let's see. First name. Tyrion. It's first name. Tyrion Shepard, I guess. We're gonna go with that. Because I couldn't move over to the other one. Warning, data corruption detected. Well, believe it or not, I was actually able to get a controller to actually work with this game Please the right reconstruct way. Profile. So I was Confirm so pissed. Pre -service history. I was so pissed off when, hold on. Both of your parents were born worries. Let's go with Earthborn. Confirm yeah. psychological profile. But yeah, I got a graphics mod running. As you can see. Soul Survivor. Ruthless. Confirm military specialization. The soldier. Hey, look at that texture pop in. It's kinda ugly. Let's go with this one. Let's see. Soldiers are combat specialists, ideal for the front lines of a firefight. Get improved health, can train in the use of all weapons types. Start with the ability to use medium armor and can specialize in heavy armor. Engineers are tech specialists using, they can decrypt security systems. I can only receive weapons trainings with pistol. I don't know. I can't decide between the engineer and the the soldier. I'm gonna go with soldier. Confirm facial identification. Let's see what we got. Like I did with Fallout, I'm probably just gonna take it, do the customization, and then, you know, cut ahead to it. So, give me just a second. Alright, so this is as good as I can make my character look. Let's keep going. Identification confirmed. Normal. Low. Active. Subtitles. Yeah, all that good stuff. Let's keep going. This is an interesting load screen. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn? No record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets. Learned to look out for himself. 
He got most of his unit killed on Torfin. He gets the job done, no matter what the cost. <laughs> Is that the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. Remains of an ancient spacefaring civilization. The decades that follow, these mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies enabling travel to fur the furthest stars. The basis for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the very fabric of space and time. Oh god damn it, I wasn't done reading! Damn it, Mass Effect! I'm really interested in how this game will play. Arcturus Prime relays in range. Initiating transmission sequence. Commander? I had a little stuttering at the beginning. That was weird. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. Is hot, acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Some really weird guns. The board is green. Approach run. Jeez, I look weird. Wish they had better options for hair, but eh. What can you do? It's not Fallout 4. It did come out in 2007, so I have to cut it to Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift. Just under 1500k. 1500 is good. Your captain will be pleased. I don't know how the original looked, but I assume this looks a lot better than that. Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. You always expect the worst. Well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so... What are we doing? Oh, that, 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 that dialogue will is really cool. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Ethan Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? He sounds angry. Something must have gone wrong with the mission. Captain always sounds like that when he's talking to me. Can't possibly imagine why. This is weird. Oh, I can just pull out the pistol. Jesus. How do I put it away? Oh, that's how. What do I got? Oh. Let's do it just... That's kind of strange. Something I'll definitely have to get used to. But okay. And we're getting dragged right along with him. Relax, Presley. You're gonna give yourself an ulcer. Congratulations, Commander. Looks like we had a smooth run. You heading down to see the captain? Sounds like you don't trust our Turian guest. Sorry, Commander. Just having a chat with Adams down at Engineering. It didn't mean to cause any trouble. 
But you have to admit, something's odd about this mission. The whole crew feels it. You think the Alliance Brass is holding out on us? If all we're supposed to do is test out the stealth system, why is Captain Anderson in charge? And then there's Nihilus. Spectres are elite operatives, top covert agents. Why send a Spectre, a Turian Spectre, on a shakedown run? It doesn't add up. You don't trust Nihilus? I don't like Turians in general. It runs in my family. My grandfather fought in the first contact war. Lost a lot of friends when the Turians hit us. That was 30 years ago. You can't blame Nihilus for that. No, I guess not. But it still makes me nervous to have a Spectre on board. Especially a Turian. We're an Alliance vessel, human military. But Nihilus doesn't answer to the Captain like the rest of us. Spectres operate outside the normal chain of command. And they don't come along just to observe shakedown runs. <laughs> Nihilus looks like he's expecting some heavy action. I don't like it. I'll see if I can get some answers when I see him. Good luck, Commander. Good stuff. I grew up on Eden Prime, Doc. It's not the kind of place Spectre's visit. There's something Nihilus isn't telling us about this mission. She's gonna do some talking. I don't really know how these RPGs what do you think, go. Commander? We won't be staying on Eden Prime too long, will we? I'm itching for some real action. I sincerely hope you're kidding, Corporal. Your real action usually ends with me patching up crew members in the infirmary. Marines are meant to fight. You just fix us up when we're done. I know how things work, Commander. I've seen my share of combat, yeah. but it's foolish to go looking for trouble. You could both take a lesson from the Captain. He's not afraid of combat, but he knows the value of restraint, too. Nah, oh, fuck Sorry, that. We Doc. go guns blazing. This waiting's killing me. I've never been on a mission like this before, not one with a Spectre on board. Do your job, follow my orders, and there won't be any problems. Easy for you to say. You proved yourself on Torfin. Everybody knows what you can do. This is my big chance. I need to show the brass what I can do. You're young, Corporal. You have a long career ahead of you. Don't do something stupid to mess it up. Don't worry, sir. I'm not gonna screw this up. The Captain's waiting for me. Bye, Commander. Nice. Is that some stupid mo motion blur? Like, messing with the graphics? That's probably what it is. I don't know. Something I can do for you, Commander? Carry on. No, we're good. I thought you were somebody yes, different. And real quick, let me save it. Because I never know when the game will crash. Got anything for me? Well, let me mess around with some settings a bit. I will be right back. Alright. I'm going to go see whoever. There's no music for some reason. What what kind of You must be the commander. Commander Shepard. I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. What about? I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. They say it's a paradise. Yes, a paradise. Serene, tranquil, safe. Eden Prime has become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? If you've got something to say, just say it. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? I think it's about time we told the Commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. I already figured that out. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. Must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. I the thought the Protheans that? vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is Big Shepard. 
The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime doesn't have the facilities to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the Citadel for proper study. Obviously, this goes beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Are we expecting trouble? I'm always expecting trouble. <laughs> There's more, Shepard. Nihilus isn't just here for the beacon. He's also here to evaluate you. Since when do we answer to the Spectres? You're smart enough to know how things work, Commander. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. I was impressed when I studied the reports from Torfin. A grim business, but you got the job done. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy, and to the Spectres. We are an elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we seek. I don't care that you're human, Shepard. I only care that you can do the job. I assume All this right. is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. Okay. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. Okay. You will be in charge <laughs> so, of the team. What are you, part of my, part of my uh, squad now? Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. I'd like to know more about Eden Prime before we touch down. It's a peaceful farming world, but it represents something much bigger. Eden Prime is one of our oldest and most successful colonies. It proved we were ready to face the challenges of settling new worlds, to forge a place for humanity beyond Earth. It symbolizes humanity's growth and evolution as a spacefaring species. And after this, it will be known as the world where humans made a discovery of galactic importance. All right, that's lovely. Can Just I go shoot work, something Captain. now? We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. Get down! What is going on? Peaceful town, huh? Ah, oh, Jesus! Are you okay? Oh, that's not good. Everything cuts out after that. No calm traffic at all. It just goes dead. There's nothing. Reverse and hold of thirty-eight point five. What the hell is that? I heard. Seventeen minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Take us in, Joker. Fast and quiet. Mission just got a lot more complicated. A small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. It's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. You gotta tell me twice. Tell Alenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. We're going in. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors Fuck is a secondary survivors. objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's help the survivors. Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. I don't like putting my life in the hands of a Turian, sir. Nihilus is on our side. He wants you in the Spectres. 
and he wants that beat. We've got his back, Captain. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck. Sir, yes, sir. We Let's are. move in. Draw out. Saving content. What do you have to say? So where do we head? This way? I don't know how I like this gun. What the hell are those? I don't know, but we're about to don't worry, they're harmless. Are they? It's a reload button. Oh, there is no reload. Swag. Alright, let's get moving. What the hell is this? Okay, I don't know what the hell all that is. No exposition! Is there a crouch button of some kind? I can't move while I'm crouched. Was this an auto cover type of thing? Yes it is. Okay. Now that's lovely. But how the hell do I get where I need to get to? Can't jump, can't do anything. I don't even know where to go. Let's assume that we need to go this way. That's where the thing dropped us off at. I don't know, you tell me. Ask Google. Jesus, they got burned alive. That's not good. Really? You've gained a level. I'm gonna go with... That one. How many points do I have? I'm not sure how many I have. I can't see them because my my camera's in the way. I mean, you guys probably won't see it, but yeah, my camera's in the way, so I can't see how many I have. I might move it eventually. Can I turn the preview off? No, I can't. I'll figure out what to do later. Combat armor. Actually, you know what? Pistols, pistols. Charm, charm, charm. And pistols. And then, I don't know if I have any more points because I can't see it, but... That's all I got. <laughs> My other teammate died, okay.
Where's he at? No. Oh. What'd you have on you, sir? Right through his shields. You're at a chance. We'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete. But I need you to stay focused. Aye, aye, sir. All right, let's keep it moving. the hell? Got him. I've got some burned out buildings here, Shepard. A lot of bodies. I'm gonna check it out. I'll try to catch up with you at the dig site. Whatever you say. Upgrade kit. I will take it. Put the sniper rifle. How do I know which one's a sniper rifle? Shepard. What in the hell kind of this sniper rifle? It's awful. Fuck that. Where's my pistol? Move! You're in my cover. I tell you what, let me switch to assault rifle. And then pistol. That way I can just switch back whenever. Oh wait, that only works with assault rifles. That's weird. I have. Got him. Let's move out. All targets down. Yo. Are you okay? I don't know how I like this game. So oh, whoa. Whoa. Oh, I almost shot you. Thanks for your help, Commander. I didn't think I was going to make it. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. All right, so what happened to the rest of you guys? Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back. I mean, I saw Homeboy get absolutely ambush. destroyed, but that's I don't about think it. Any of the others? I think I'm the only one left. I already know it killed them. This isn't your fault, Williams. You couldn't have done anything to save them. Yes, sir. We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? I don't know. They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Let's get it done. Move out. Equipped an item. Grenade launcher. Let's see. Shotgun. Pistol.
got any more dialogue options for me? These squad members. Squad. All these whatchamacallits, they're so... Yeah, after this part, I'm probably gonna switch where the preview is. Do I have no points to give to her? There's me. How am I going down the renegade path? I don't understand. Let me go ahead and save it, just in case. I don't know how I'm going down the renegade path. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. Whatever the hell. Okay, so I have new equipment. Oh, that's medium armor. I think I'm good. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Jesus! <sighs> okay. Get in there. I haven't tried this assault rifle yet. Whoa! Jesus! Can I blind fire? No. Okay. That's a crate. Okay, so combat in this game isn't the best. I will say that. But it gets the job done. Let's see. More pistols. And then, all right, I guess we're good. You still don't have anything. You still don't have anything. I'm I'm really new to this this RPG crap. You know, all these stats, all this. I mean, I'm this I'm just used to side. just shooting the hell out of the everything. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the gas? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. All right, then let's go there. We make for the. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramp. The audio cut out. What? Change of plan, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Okay. Now, I just need to figure out where to go. That's my main next issue, is I don't know where to go. Oh, okay. We're going this way. That makes sense. I was just a bit off base. Looks like they hit the camp hard, hard. Yeah, I can see that. Keep your guard up. Oh, my guard's always Jesus. What happened to you? Oh God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? So I could just... Jesus, that's not good. Open fire, team. Ah! Kill it. And there's no reload, so... Bag him and tag him. We should move. We should move, Commander. As you wish.
That door, it's closed. Security locks engaged. Use a D pass to advance to the central core. Avoid the security programs. What? Ah, oh, is this some hacking? S I don't even know. What even is the mini game? I don't get it. <sighs> I hate these hacking mini games. I don't know what the Oh, okay. I get it now. I get it now. Oh, okay. For humans, thank the maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. What are you doing here? I'm Dr. Warren. I was in charge of this excavation. We hid in the shed during the attack. They must have come for the beacon. Luckily, it wasn't here. It was moved to the spaceport earlier this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. Whatever you say, man. Take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Something wrong with this guy. You're wasting your time. The age of humanity is over. Our extinction is inevitable. Say good night, Manuel. The darkness is coming. The end is near. You can't. <laughs> Jesus! Oh my god! What did you do? That was a little extreme, Commander. You can't just go around whacking people in the head. Just a little bump on the head. Let him sleep it off. I suppose you're right. By the time he wakes up, the meds will have kicked in. <laughs> Woo! I didn't even mean to do that. Hit him right in the head. Got some Omni Gel. Let's take a look at my equipment real quick. See what we're rocking. I turn this thing into Omni Gel. Shots before overheat. Turn that to in the Omni Gel too. Just try to free, free up some space, I guess. Forgot what I mapped quick save to. Okay. So we're good. Sarah. Who? Nihilus. Oh, this is about to be good. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Uh oh. What is that? Off in the distance. It's a ship. Look at the size of it. I 
see it. Okay, so what are your thoughts on the situation? What are your thoughts on the situation? Commander, it's Nihilus. He got taken out the game. Jesus. Turian, you know him? He's a Spectre. He was with us on the normal. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't! Don't shoot! I'm one of you! I'm human! Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I, I'm sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. I need to know how Nihilus died. The other one got here first. He was waiting when your friend showed up. He, he called him Saren. I, I think they knew each other. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I, I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Then what? Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I hadn't been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I, I, I was already behind the crates when the attack started. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I... I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? If you hadn't snuck off for that nap, you'd probably be dead just like all the others. Yeah... Yeah, I guess. I don't really want to think about it. We right, need let's to get find out of here. beacon before it's too late. The cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. You do that. Five by five, Commander. Why am I? Jesus! I can't shoot. What? I couldn't shoot. I was in the cover. Oh, my hair. But I couldn't shoot. That was ridiculous. Hostile contact. Yeah, these. Why couldn't I shoot? Let me heal what's his face. Yeah, these these can combat controls. They're not the best. Not a bad long shot. Jesus. Fuck. Squad. What the hell is that? And why can't I kill the thing? Order him to do what? Nice.
Whoa! Is he dead? He's dead! Yo! What? No! What kind of... Whoops! Combat in this game is really bad. I mean, really bad. Got him. I've lost shields. Why doesn't he crouch when I need to get in the cover? I don't get it. Jesus, combat in this game sucks. Crouch! Fuck. Use the med gel. Jesus Christ. Got one. Okay. So what's his face is dead. That's not good. Oh no, he's not dead. Dude, I thought you were taking out the game. Jesus. You all right? I'm not though. Which one did I make quick save? I can't remember. I made one of these buttons quick save. But yeah, I almost took him out. Stay right here. I'm still getting used to these controls. They're not the best by a long shot, not at all. It's one thing I've never liked about RPGs is the controls are just awful. At least the train's activated. Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. You are extremely ugly. Jeez. Ooh. What happened? Uh oh. These are some really tacky spacesuits. Finally, some action. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. That's one. Whoa! Plus shields. Get over there. Fuck. Plus shields. Jesus. What is that? Switch to the plus shields. Come on, really? <sighs> Let's move. I'll stay right here. I'll stay right here. Push forward. 
Yeah, combat in this game is not a strong point at all. I hear that I hear the later games improve, but this is this. The combat is really bad. I'm not gonna even gonna sugarcoat it. Shit, I'm overheated. Where's my... Yeah, combat in this game is... Ugh. Maybe I just haven't got the hang of it yet, but... Got him. That's another one. And there's one more. Where is it at? Where's my pistol? No idea where the last one will be at. Oh, right here. Squad. Roll up. What are you doing? Squad! Why are you not following me? It's probably because I told him to hold up by accident. Yeah, these controls, they're gonna take some getting used to. These aren't your every average day controls for shooters. Let's go! How do I tell them follow me? What the hell are they doing? Not in the middle of a fight. What fight? There's nobody here to fight. Oh, that fight. Take him out! Oh. Think we're good, Commander. I'm not. I'm about to die. Someone help me. <sighs> Recoil dampener. See, recoil dampener. And then... What the hell did I put on this? Alright, let's go with that. Sniper rifle I don't really care about. Nice. Assault rifle. No, no, no. What did I even... I'll pass. Actually, you know, I'll go ahead and use it. In the meantime, let's look around. Maybe there's... I doubt it, though. Some kind of something I can look at? Yeah, like this over here? What's in here? Storage locker. Shit. 
Get in there. God damn it. Come on. Ugh. Okay, whatever. Let's keep it moving. Wonder what's gonna happen here. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. That's because aliens, must bro. Have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. Ew, why are you looking like that? You... Why, oh why, did you get too close to that thing? Oh no. Shepard! No, don't touch it! It's too dangerous! Ooh. Ooh. Um. Um. So, do we, you're just gonna ignore that, you know, an alien artifact? An alien artifact just you know blasted in my face like what is even going on right now we identified oh, hello. the ship that touched hey. down on yeah, Prime. it's like you have a beard Normandy, a human alliance vessel it was under the command of captain anderson they managed to save the colony and the beacon one of the humans may have used it <laughs> I knew it was gonna growl. <laughs> Look at it, she's just like, eh, all in a day's work. This human must be eliminated. <laughs> she's just like, eh, whatever. Doctor, Doctor Chakwas, I think he's waking up. Yeah, I'm good. You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Not too good. How did I end up here? How long was I out? That's what I want to know. Oh, About hi there. Hours. Actually, kind of cute. Hello. There with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. You had no way to know what would happen. Actually, we don't even know if that's what set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find it out. It was the aliens, bro. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. I appreciate it. Physically, you're fine, but I detected some unusual brain activity, abnormal beta waves. Are you trying to tell me I'm retarded? An increase in your rapid eye movement, signs typically associated with intense dreaming. I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death? Destruction? Nothing's really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my <laughs> I like how the make... I like how the horror music oh, starts and then just nice. stops out of nowhere. How's our exo holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the command is going to be fine. Glad to hear it, Shepard. I need to speak with you, in private. Sir, yes, sir. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? I don't like soldiers dying under my command. Jenkins wasn't your fault. You did a good job, Shepard. Chief Williams isn't part of the Normandy crew. I figured we could use a soldier like her. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. 
Lieutenant Elenko agrees with you. That's why I added her to our crew. You said you, you needed to, to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Geth are invading. The Council's going to want answers. I didn't do anything wrong, Captain. Hopefully the Council can see that. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. Saren's a specter, one of the best. A living, living legend. legend. But if he's working with the Geth, it means he's gone rogue. <gasps> a rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous, and he hates humans. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But he does. allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how. I don't know why. I only know it had something to do with that beacon. You were there just before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. What are we gonna tell him? I had a bad dream? <laughs> we don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation, his politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command, and he won't stop until he's wiped humanity from the face of the galaxy. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the Council on our side. Why don't we just shoot him in the face? We prove Saren's gone rogue, and the Council will revoke his Spectre status. I'll contact the Ambassador, and see if he can get us an audience with the Council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Sir, yes sir. Anyway guys, I want to thank you for watching. Remember to leave a like if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you want to see more. Share this video around. Share it with your friends. Share it with other YouTubers. I'm going to be playing through all three of these games so I can get caught up in time for Mass Effect uh, Andromeda. I believe that's what it's called. But uh, yeah, I will catch you around.